To an amazing discovery, an amateur Israeli scuba diver found a sword that likely belonged to a crusader knight almost a millennium ago. We take a look at the numbers. 900 years old, the estimated age of this iron sword found in the seabed off the coast of Hia, Israel. It was a ground-shattering moment when a diver spotted a 900-year-old mythical sword lying in the shallow waters surrounding Israel. Another mind-boggling moment was when researchers investigating the deep blue sea captured a colossal squid, one with a striking resemblance to the famed legend of the Kraken. These and many other shocking discoveries tell of the breathtaking wonders hidden in the depths of our oceans. These enigmatic wonders, once again, come to light when deep-sea divers plunge into treacherous depths, but some are so shocking that if they weren't captured, no one would believe them. Join us in this video as we reveal 15 strangest things found by deep-sea divers. And just so you know, no one was supposed to find this. If a diver didn't capture this, no one would believe. Number 15. Crusader Sword In the early months of 2021, a recreational diver off Israel's Caramel Coast encountered a glistening object poking mysteriously from the seafloor. Swimming closer down to a depth of about 60 feet, he noticed it was a full-sized medieval broadsword. But this wasn't just any sword, it was a 900-year-old relic with a legendary backstory. The diver had stumbled upon a rare crusader weapon dating to the iconic Holy Wars when European armies sought to claim the Holy Land. Tucked in the wet sands for centuries, the blade stood unwithered and perfectly preserved. After meticulously chipping away the moss and dirt covering it, scientists revealed the fascinating steel weapon with an uncorroded iron blade. How did this blade manage to stay so clean after nearly a thousand years? The enigmatic sword sparked theories, with some suggesting it had mystical powers, while others felt it was sheathed before falling into the sea. Either way, this sword remains the most significant reminder of this ancient war era. Our next discovery reminds us of another era when pirates ruled the seas. Number 14. Blackbeard Cannons The vast waters surrounding North Carolina abound with legends of notorious pirates who ruled the waters centuries ago. Of all the pirates, the name Blackbeard is the most revered. The British pirate plundered the Caribbean and colonial American waters, amassing power and riches so great that he had a fleet or sea army. However, in 1718, several naval forces converged to eliminate his treacherous reign. Years ago, marine technicians stumbled upon a massive cannon embedded in the sands of Atlantic Beach, weighing a colossal 2,000 pounds. The size and pattern of the cannon matched records of those used in the great battle that ended the pirate's reign. Plus, other metallic artifacts that looked a lot like pirate machinery were found. Finding pirate ship remains may be exciting, but this next discovery is something out of the ordinary. Number 13. Yonaguni Monument About 100 feet below the raging waves of Japan's Ryukyu Islands lies one of the most enigmatic underwater formations ever discovered, the Yonaguni Formation. This intriguing 150-fat-long composite rock structure sent shockwaves throughout the archaeological community, hinting at the possibility of an ancient alien civilization. The puzzling discovery was brought to light in 1987 by a diver, and since then, researchers have debated its man-made or natural origins. The sensational wonder boasts notched projections, flat parallel faces, sharp steps, and large squared blocks, all suggesting it was carefully and purposefully crafted. Some theorists propose that this mystery monument may be the foundation of a submerged Neolithic settlement flooded by the rising seas. Although no one knows what ancient settlement this monument belonged to, its original alluring texture and fascinating architecture attract divers worldwide. Running bare hands over the cracks and edges of the surface of this monument gives a feeling like no other, making Yonaguni's sunken ruins a favorite destination for touring divers. But then, the Yonaguni ruin doesn't come close to this next discovery which has long been labeled a special destination for underwater tourists. Number 12. World War II. Fighter Plane. 
World War II was one of the most epic wartime periods in the history of humanity. The chaotic war spanned oceans and continents, lasting from 1939 to 1945, with raging battles, destructive war technology, and countless deaths. This era greatly shaped today's world order. However, few relics from this era are as special as this well-preserved fighter plane. The war-era vintage plane was found by sonar images lying upright about 13,000 feet down in the deep waters. As cameras drew in on this captivating finding, its sharp wings came into view with details about its military insignia. War veterans suggest it could be a rare Curtis P-40 Warhawk, the American fighter-bomber vessel frequently launched for combat missions over the Pacific. Some experts have suggested that this unlucky plane may have missed a deck landing attempt, thereby ending up in the water's abyss, but it stands as a time capsule into the decisive Battle of the Coral Sea, when several nations locked horns in a world-ending battle for the ages. It's still a mystery where this plane ended up and how it did. But this next discovery is even more mysterious, because it had no business being in the water. Number 11. Underwater Train Tomb Lying helplessly on the seafloor off the coast of New Jersey is a long-forgotten 18th century technological marvel dating back over 170 years. The rare, top-class steam engines had been forgotten to the seabeds of time until they were glimpsed for the first time in 1985 by a local diver. Their discovery sparked interest, with many experts questioning their origin and burial story. How were these vintage relics lost and forgotten in an underwater grave? Out of the dozen relics found, the models included the Triple Two T, thought to date back to the 1850s. Remarkably, the metal bodies of these ancient trains are still intact despite decades of corrosive action from salty seawater. The intriguing images show these trains lined up neatly in their final resting place almost resembling an underwater railway station waiting dutifully for passengers. The true story behind their watery demise is still unknown. Some experts suggest a storm may have been responsible, and others believe the trains were deliberately sunk after being deemed as scraps. Speaking of scraps from a bygone era, none is as compelling as this next discovery. Number 10. World War II. Silver. An exploration team made the discovery of a lifetime in March 2013, when they successfully hauled up over 1,200 kilograms of silver bullion lost during World War II. Using advanced sonar remote vehicles and 5,800 meters of cable, the crew scanned the seafloor for what was once thought to be lost forever. Lying not too far away from the Titanic wreckage, this 412-foot British cargo was a priceless war commando. The craft sank in February 1941 after a German bomber attacked, going down with a silver payload insured at 600,000 pounds. This loss contributed to the UK being driven off the gold standard shortly after. However, those who suffered the most shock were the families of the 86 men lost at sea. Finding this ancient silver bullion wasn't just a restoration of a long-lost treasure, but closure for families of the deceased. But speaking of long-lost treasures, the next discovery is a million-dollar treasure that transformed the life of its finder. Number 9. Lost Treasure of Gold Coins In July 2015, Eric Schmidt, a professional salvager, hit the jackpot of a lifetime when he uncovered a long-lost treasure of gold coins worth over $1 million. The mind-blowing treasure was discovered in an unnamed 1715 Spanish shipwreck site off Florida's Treasure Coast. Although tales of places like Treasure Island may have put the idea of becoming a treasure hunter in Eric Schmidt's mind, he was overjoyed after realizing he had stumbled upon Earth's richest unsalvaged wreck area. The wreckage dates back 300 years to when Spain dominated the world, amassing much of South America's wealth. It wasn't uncommon for Spanish ships, heavily laden with gold and riches of all kinds, to travel the rough seas en route to Europe sailing along Florida's eastern shoreline. However, things turned for the worse in July 1715, when a massive hurricane hit, sinking 10 Spanish treasure ships and dispersing their fortunes hundreds of miles across the continental shelf. To this day, this remains one of the greatest single losses of gold and silver in history. 
the total value of what was lost is about half a billion in today's economy. Schmidt made his unexpected life-transforming discovery in 2015 while magnet fishing for scraps. His joy knew no bounds when he found 51 gold coins beneath the sands within seconds, followed by hundreds more, all well-preserved. But while Schmidt's discovery was a joy to the entire nation, this next one was a terror to everyone who saw it. Number 8. Colossal Squid For long, there have been tales and speculations of colossal creatures lurking beneath the deep blue sea. With more than 70% of our oceans unexplored, scientists and researchers are confident that many horrors may exist in the deepest, darkest parts of our seas where no diver has ever dared venture. Into one such horror came to light somewhere in the twilight zone depths of the Southern Ocean between Antarctica and New Zealand, the Colossal Squid. This legendary finding made public enthusiasts revive tales of the Kraken, a mythical sea monster that tore away at ships and pirates, causing chaos like the world has never seen. Experts suggest that this colossal squid, though not as large as the mind-blowing shipwreck in Kraken, has the potential to rival even supersized sperm whales in size. Imagine how terrifying it would be to find a 33-ton squid with massive arms and propellers waddling its way toward you. This is exactly how a 2019 team of scientists felt when they launched a camera into the deep sea, only to be greeted by this monstrosity. Experts had only once seen an adult colossal squid in 2007, but this new specimen inspired new ideas of what we thought was possible in evolution. Speaking of terrifying discoveries, this ancient skull comes next on the list. Number 7. 13. 000. Year Old Skull. One of the most common archaeological findings is ancient human skeletal remains. These ancient decaying bones allow us to peer back in time, gaining insight into the remarkable lives of our ancestors. However, no previous human remains have slowed us from peering deep into the past like this 13 year old skull. Inarguably the oldest known human fossil in all of America, this skull belonged to a teenage girl who lived nearly 13,000 years ago. Found 100 feet underwater by a team of divers scanning a pitch-black Mexican sea note, the relic named Nia, or the water nymph, has long become a treasure in the archaeological community. In case you're wondering how a bone structure managed to stay intact for a millennium, it's because the cave in which it was found had been sealed for at least 1,000 years. Experts suggest the teenager may have fallen 100 feet into the cave shaft and died quickly from her injuries in the cold, dark waters. While this may have been a sad way to go, Nia's intriguing remains have offered every detail they could wish for, right from her pelvis to her dental cavities. Number 6. Arctic Hydromedusa Resembling a phantom creature from the nether realm, the Arctic Hydromedusa is one of the most abnormal creatures of the deep. Many have described this phenomenal creature as an alien species of jellyfish. The perplexing creatures are found drifting silently across polar seas with wispy tentacles and fragile bells, resembling something out of this world. What's even more shocking is that these ethereal creatures survive and thrive in one of the harshest places on Earth the unforgiving icy waters of the Arctic Ocean. It's still a wonder how their gelatinous bodies don't get immobilized by the freezing black depths. As if this wasn't already perplexing enough, these medusas are known to descend to depths over 3,300 feet in a quest to catch plankton and other small fish that make up their diet. Adding to the enigma is the fact that these creatures have bioluminescent powers, allowing them to emit an otherworldly biotic glow as they slowly wave through the icy waters. The Hydromedusa certainly stands apart as evidence of nature's never-ending diversity. This next discovery stands as evidence of nature's ingenuity. Number 5. Underwater Crop Circles Japanese divers were shocked beyond words when they encountered strange circular geometric designs underwater in the region of Amamioshima Island in the mid-1990s. The mysterious structures, ranging from 6 to 13 feet, featured elaborate carvings on the seafloor. As years passed, more of these patterns were found in faraway underwater sites in Israel and Europe. 
The enigma puzzled scientists for a long time, yet no one could tell who created them or why. At one time, theories of extraterrestrial visitors began to take root. But in the end, scientists were shocked beyond words when they finally found the entity behind this mystery. It turns out that the skilled underwater architecture was the handiwork of male puffer fishes. These creatures built these structures as attractive mating nests to entice females. Usually, a male spends up to 10 days tirelessly flapping his fins to create the beautiful curved ridges and every other part of this splendid nest. In the end, he decorates the rims with shells or coral fragments, creating one of the most glorious and precise structures you'd ever see in nature. Our next discovery takes us on a trip to Egypt. Number 4. The Black Pharaoh's Tomb Deep beneath the steady Nile waters lies a relic from a phenomenal era in ancient Egypt, the era of the Nubian Black Pharaohs. The mighty pharaohs ruled for 50 years, though their memories were wiped off from the official Egyptian historical accounts, probably for racist reasons. As such, you can imagine the fantasy when divers first encountered tantalizing underwater magnificent structures along the Nile that date back to this era. Archaeological experts soon began to find ways of restoring the rich legacy of these Nubian kings, setting up temples and museums to incorporate their memories. But it wasn't until a life-sized black granite statue of Pharaoh Taharqa, one of Nubia's most prosperous rulers, was found submerged in the Egyptian waters that a turning point came for this venture. Since then, more shocking relics from this era have been popping up on the scene, further upstream of the Nile. Finding unexpected discoveries like these is one of the most rewarding things for archaeologists and divers. However, sometimes it isn't just relics that lie in the deep but strange creatures that can become more than what you could ever imagine. Number 3. Best Friend Fish No one would believe that becoming best friends with a fish at sea would be possible, at least not unless it's a dolphin. However, a Japanese diver did the impossible when he befriended a little aquatic friend in the Blue Seas just outside a small Japanese island. This unlikely cross-species relationship was one of a kind, as the little sea creature always came darting out of its hiding place every time the diver came knocking. The 79-year-old diver, named Hiroyuki Arakawa, had formed this enigmatic bond about 30 years ago when he rescued the poor fish from a life-threatening situation. Seeing the fish tangled up in a fishing line that left deep cuts on her back, this compassionate diver played the role of a knight in shining armor, gently saving the fish and then nursing her back to health through regular feeding and care. As the fish recovered, Arakawa became the best friend in the world to Yoriko, and as years passed, their bond only solidified. The fascinating cross-species relationship has stood the test of time, surviving against skepticism and every other uncanny odd. The next discovery only reminds the scientific community of a tragedy long forgotten. Number 2. Space Shuttle Challenger Debris It was a tragic day for the scientific community when a space shuttle carrying seven astronauts disintegrated over Cape Canaveral. The Space Shuttle Challenger, launched on January 28, 1986, had barely spent one minute in the air when it met an untimely demise, killing everyone on board. Millions watched this tragic event unfold live, and pretty much no one could do anything but gasp for air as the million-dollar spacecraft came crashing into the Atlantic Ocean. Authorities launched a fatal search for months, combing the surface of nearby fields, but nothing was found except the eight-ton nose cone sheathing the vessel's heart. However, in March 2022, an impossible blip on sonar's radar revealed something new. A documentary crew that had been assessing World War II bomber wrecks off Florida spotted skeletal shuttle remains lodged in the sands of a seafloor desert. Many of the parts bore a striking resemblance to what was done in the space shuttle, including the iconic nose lockers that housed the unfortunate crew compartment. This discovery was a monumental one, as a long-lost relic had just come to life. Though the remains had become coated in three decades of coral growth, still, it stood as a remembrance of the seven men who gave their lives for humanity's never-ending quest of cosmic exploration. The newly discovered remains will preserve this legendary story for generations to come. Speaking of legends, 
this next discovery brought an ancient legend, which was considered a myth, to life. Number 1. Road to Atlantis The legend of Atlantis is undoubtedly one of the most captivating legends of all time. From tales of war and technological exploits, to rumors of alien ancestry and supernatural prowess, the ancient city of Atlantis has always been wrapped in many mesmerizing truths, myths, and mysteries. Swallowed by the merciless waves of the ocean, the city of Atlantis has always been believed to be lying somewhere beneath the deep. However, neither ancient Greek philosophers nor modern-day researchers have been able to map out the exact burial site of this once great civilization, but things took a different turn when one diver found something shocking beneath the treacherous waves of the deep blue sea, something that reminded him of Atlantis. This perplexing discovery was made in the late 1960s in the crystal-clear Caribbean waters. The never-before-seen arrangement of straight megalithic stone formations underwater was quite intriguing, resembling the road to a very important temple or location. Researchers wasted no time hopping on this zero, six-mile-long enigma located off North Bimini Island in the Bahamas. The out-of-place stone arrangement amongst the backdrop of natural jagged limestone and reef was like nothing ever discovered before. This made historians and enthusiastic folks in the scientific community suggest that it may be the road to the lost city of Atlantis. Interestingly, the location of this awe-inspiring discovery coincided with the exact place that the famous psychic Edgar Case had predicted. But although the Bimini Road matches the coordinates of this famous clairvoyant, geologists have suggested that it may not have anything to do with Atlantis after all. In fact, these stone experts see the discovery as naturally formed beach rocks created by the precipitation of carbonates. Some even argue that the rocks resemble beach rocks found on the shores of Bimini Island. However, Atlantis theorists argue that there's no way for beach rocks to form so uniformly underwater except they were carefully designed and put in place. In any case, this remains one of the most fabulous discoveries of the 21st century, and no one knows how many more like these are lurking under the seas. Thank you for watching another episode of Space Voyager. While you're still here, click on the video on your screen to see more mind-blowing videos like this one.